Well, good morning, and this video goes out to Paper Vampire. <laughs> Here's my grass. Or if we can... Is that better? You can see more of the grass now. Okay, so we have some nice grass up in the back there, or at least most of it looks like grass, some of it's just weeds. Um, but then you've got all these brownie patches and whatever. Okay, so what's been happening is like a lot of this around here was a lot more bare until I came along. And if we can get up closer, right? So there's, there's things like this and these clumps like that. And so th th it's a different kind of grass to what mum's into, which is this garbage here, which does not grow very well at all. I don't know how well you can see, but there's this, hang on, this sort of triangle along here, right? She bought from the hardware store and just like slapped down. Um, on the upside, it stops the dogs from digging up dirt when they're dancing around here, but it hasn't grown well at all. So, yeah, you've only got little bits like that and the rest is dead. Dead, 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 dead. So, what happens is, like, with some of this other random grass, um, it just pops up around the place. I can't find any today, but usually it's around here. And what I do is I, like, pick it up and then plant it back here. And this is one I did recently. And um, it's already growing, so I'm like, why would you waste your time with grass like this that clearly doesn't really want to be here when you've got this kind of grass that is happy and it's spring and it's growing all these little seeds and then it spreads the seeds and then it grows more for like zero effort and zero money. Like, yeah, so I like this patch, for example, completely bare until I planted, I think maybe this one and then it's just spread. Very quickly, this is all in the last few months. Um, you know, keep pa planting patches around the place and then it spreads and then some of it, like I think further over there, more of it has just happened by itself. But yeah, and it keeps spreading and I figure if I keep doing that, you know, we will have less of a patchy lawn. Um, but no, of course, you know, while I'm doing all this and you can see you know, there's like some little babies that are growing. I didn't plant those. Those have popped up since I started doing this. And so, you know, every now and then you get these tiny, tiny little seedlings. And then mum goes and slaps unhappy grass on top. And then you can see the, the difference in the soils, right? You know, some that's a bit more light colored, some that's dark colored. The dark colored is topsoil. She just grabbed a bag and chucked it everywhere. And I'm like, mum, I'm, I'm working on a project here. Don't smother all my seedlings but um yeah no that's what she's done uh this, this i think most of it is sort of growing through but like she's so impatient and it's the same with like all our plants like here right here's our parsley and it was like in this tiny little bag thing and dying i have video diaries of this and she's like it's dead throw it out but i planted it into a bigger pot and now it's been growing so well that she's actually you can see she's used a bunch of it you know she's just impatient i'm like mum you just need to care for stuff and wait for it to grow it's not dead it's fine and then for some other grass things so yeah i do have <laughs> video diaries of all this stuff that from the past few years that I'll probably never get around to editing, but here is some cat grass that just went completely nuts and now it's too big um, and I should probably chop it down and I've already repotted it once because the roots were insane and they're probably insane again, but so um, that's some grass and this one is different to the other ones because here's the seeds <laughs> and so of course I have harvested a bunch of the seeds and then gone, what the hay, I will plant them and they started growing. So here's my own cat grass that I've grown from my own seeds that I harvested at home and it looks happy. Should I plant it into the garden? Uh, I don't know, you know, into the lawn there. Um, maybe I got the cat grass for Hope because, you know, he was getting stomach issues and he likes to eat grass and cat grass is one of the, the better ones. Um, but yeah, so mum's like, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm planting cat grass. And she's like, okay. So yeah, that's some stuff about our grass and what I'm trying to do here. And mum's impatient attempts to sabotage me on that. <laughs> We're watching grass grow, guys. Oh dear. Um, yeah, and my parents 
sort of just having to accept that I'm one of these nutcases who does strange things. Let's call it being an artist, right? You're not supposed to understand anything that I do. Um, speaking of not understanding anything that I do, it is oh, seven in the morning because Mikey woke up at like 5.30 and I had to go and yell at him. Let's look at grass some more because that gets tiring. Um, I had to yell at him and send him back to bed because he was yelling and stomping and I'm just like 5.30, it's too early. He went back to bed and I just wasn't able to sleep. So yeah, I'm up at seven. The parents have gone out for a dog walk and that's why I'm here rambling to myself about grass. So I hope you guys enjoyed that, staring at grass and all the weird stuff I'm doing. Uh, actually, this one is a pretty recent as well. I planted it on top of mum's crap grass. And look, he's already happy, you know? Like, why fight nature? Clearly this grass is not happy here. You know, it, it died almost immediately. Um, whereas my grass, and most of this has happened since I started working on it, um, and it even grows in this crappy, muddy soil. Like, come on, go with nature. Nature is saying, this is the grass that is suited to this lawn. Stop wasting your time with this, you know. Um, and, you know, half of that is actually weeds anyway, and when you mow it all down, it all looks the same, so what's the problem? The only one that I'm not going to put in here is onion weed, but we already have some onion weed around the place. Let's see if I can find some. Look at that. Onion weed. Right in the middle of that horrible, horrible thing right there. We don't like those. But we do like my, my grass that just... That one popped up by itself, you know. It pops up by itself. It's saying, I like to be here. Unlike this garbage. So yeah guys, grass. Also, um, this white stuff, that's the Labrador's fur, Marley's fur. Um, would be funny if we started growing doggos, but that's not really how that works. Anyway, I'm gonna go back inside. Oh, actually, maybe I should water everything. It's gonna rain later today, but, you know, I think it's gonna be a little bit warm. Also, it's really smoky today because it's Australia and we have to burn the bush every now and then so that when summer comes, we don't all go up in flames. Like last last year or the year before, I don't even remember. Um, yeah, no, I might water everything and then I'll make some tea and see if I can stay awake or if I have to nap because it is way too early in the morning. Like, there's not even sun, it's just, where does the sun come from? I don't even know. Um, yeah, it's, it's too early in the morning, and there's a damn good chance I'm just going to have to go back to bed. Anyway, that's all I've got for you guys. Have a good day or whatever.